apply my rapping skills in me trying to sing. Okay. So like rapping in a melodious way. That's what I'm doing. So I've not really stopped. Yeah, just that my jai had hardcore one because it wasn't really helping. And you know, before I didn't have a strong rapping voice. I had the lyrics, but my vocals wasn't really heavy enough to, you know, keep me, you know, very, very strong in the rap game. But you know, my lyrics and everything is I just applied them. You know, my styling up, KK. My styling up, but I enjoy. I say hard, hard one a day, you know, the what. And me call freestyles and so if I go for interviews and I'm being asked to give you a freestyle, my own rap. I know the few rap I'm. Mm. Yeah. Why? At a point, I'm in class, a spirit to be a for real. You so, couldn't remember them. Me and Kaime raps. A good many more several times uh, on a lot of, you know, radio stations. Your mm. pop it's Nibia, I mean, baby, put the uh, new interview, you know. No, no, to me to rap, you know. <laughs> but new to me to. Really? Yeah, into me, Jai. That's why I stopped. That's the main reason why I stopped. You couldn't remember. Yeah. Well, but there's no news. Remember Sarko DZ teams? And sometimes, oh, shall it be on my eyes? I say, oh, cry. <laughs> ah, me forget it. Me forget it. Me, I'm a bit neighbor. I'm a total papa. So, so that's that's the main, the main, main reason why, apart from the business side, you know. Uh, because I had no rap on it. I'm fast. Come over there. Come over there. You remember this beat? Yeah, yeah. Mike B, I tell you, no. Hey, this is my music. Ah, Magina. Yeah. Remember? I remember small. Ah, my. My family is good, sir. Skinny boss, on I'm the social media bulla. Black stars belong to me. I'm the owner. Baby, I do my own thing. Oh no. I don't like it, I just remembered. <laughs> I remember Hagla used to play the song. I would, I would get into the studio and insult him. Why? Why they play the song? Why? Hey, bro. Now they do with me among you, bro. Why did you like it? Why did you like it? Oh, I tried to I didn't like it. <laughs> oh, I see. Wow. Okay. Now, the main reason I wanted you to stay, Banner Boy is saying something mm-hmm. that rappers, <laughs> rappers, as I said, okay, now, rap and shit and fasa. Mm-hmm. Banner Boy says African rappers cannot penetrate the international market. What's your take on it? Before you, you answer, Let's listen to how he said it so that my okay, okay, elders will also okay, okay. hear him. It's important for African native artists to know themselves. It's important for African native artists to be proud of themselves. You understand? It's important for African native artists to, when they come out to the world, you know, when they come outside their home, to all to know who they are, and not forget, and not try to conform. You cannot go to um, America and try to offer Americans rap or or trap or whatever you understand because they have that already what are you bringing like why is why they, you understand so if you're a native african i say you go over there bring them what's happening there it's new for them they you teach them you understand so that's what they should that's what they should learn me don't worry about me <laughs> so that was random boy What's your take on it? I I think there's a little bit of truth in there because um, looking at our industry now here in Ghana, um, um, we have few rappers who, who who were able to make it to the international, you know, um, international standards or level, which is like Sakode and there's a few. I don't know if you can if I can mention any. Sure, other. sure, sure. I don't mind. Yeah, Sakode. Who else? Adam. I'm the same year old. Rappers need the Ghana phone can no cry. Apart from Sakwe, I don't know rapper like street, streetly rapper. Me to me, I can say he has taken 
rap music to another level. D Black. No, I think so. Could they manifest? Eh, uh, but D Black also. Uh, but D Black went to the BET. Yeah, one <coughs> of the first. No. Yes, it's true. You see, no, I know. See, I'm not just talking about. Um, the but rapper. D Black he the rap oh. He the rap. No, I'm not I mean, talking about. I feel like people are not paying attention <coughs> no, no, to no, D Black. No. That be I beg me. I never start in USF talk say uh-huh. Black. No. D Black the rap. But I'm just trying to tell you about so far. You see, I will be sad. Kwa labi ya se. Yeah, growing up on me, 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 you know, be say who is the best rapper in Ghana. No more does, but everybody will say Sakode. Right. But no be answer on the favorite. Right. And we mentioned Sakode because um a lot of people went to BET, but Sakode coin a you understand. You know, impact, you know, we felt it and features Nigeria. It's not about just going to BET. So to me, cross call Nigeria uh, international. To go for him, you know features everywhere you know mm-hmm. from every side so that's what i'm saying Sakode. you understand and apart from him you know there are a lot of people i thought say they they would have taken the rap game to another level they couldn't because because of the language now i mean i mean i'm um, back about yeah i told you to say local songs like this you know People keep telling us that the language is a barrier and we can't travel with this kind of thing. Yes, at the Intina, what's it Ghana? Now, per se, oh, Niji, the same thing. You understand? You can't because I do So, the only way you can, Sakode was flying to that level was because of the native language he was using. You understand? Cultural staffs in the home, but the rest, you know, I said, do do now, I know, I know. Oh, I wish I was going to me, no, and no, and no, you understand. So, for Bernard Boy to say, say, rappers, African rappers cannot penetrate into the international market, I think he says something like that because they, they want to see something new, something cultural, you understand. So, it is difficult because of these reasons I've said. First of all, the style, um, the roots, roots behind your rapping, drew music, Albania, that in there, and yeah, you like what I say. So, if if you are going to continue doing drill music and all this, you know, slurring rap near the Emfa, Emfa, in Richie, what I say, rather, no, we should all, you know, him push here, there, you know, high life, you know, but to say, Afro beat a basis and we could have pushed high life to, to that level, you understand? Now, and yet to say, because right now we are all looking, if, 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 if somebody won't go international, he won't pass through Nigeria. <laughs> Which is wrong if you not be like that. People for pass through it high life before high life will be there. What I say now, you know, so okay, we are selling our, our culture to, to the world because that is what Bernard Boy is doing. Bernard Boy, you know, they fly because of it. When you listen to his music, there's a lot of message, culture, content room. You understand? On one year, Afrobeat in the KKB, Brain, Afrobeat in about what's it, Ben Afrobeat in a very rich. So he knows what he's saying. So I think I'm. There's mm. a little bit of truth in there because right. somebody go free actually spoiled there 